This woman is exposing one of the largest black market baby adoption rings in American history. A lot of the mothers didn't know that they even had a baby because the doctor lied and he said that the babies had died. Jane Blasio was one of those babies. She was delivered by a country doctor, Thomas Hicks. The doctor was brazenly selling babies for $1,000 each, but where he got the babies was even more chilling. Soon after the delivery, he would tell the new mother that her baby was dead. Dr. Hicks' dark, shadowy world spanned the 40s, 50s, and 60s, and is the focus of Taken at Birth, airing on TLC. What did your father tell you? Dr. Hicks had told him to bring cash, and when he got down there, the they handed the baby out the back and he gave him the cash. Now the amateur sleuth is using her research skills to track down all those Hicks babies. So far, more than 15 Hicks babies have been reunited with families they didn't know they had. Have you ever seen somebody reuniting for the first time, setting their eyes on someone for the first time? I mean, it's just, wow. But Jane says there could still be as many as 200 Hicks babies out there. Paul Raymond is a Hicks baby. He grew up in Akron, Ohio, the son of loving adoptive parents. But he says his father never let on about the existence of Dr. Hicks. He wanted to take this to his grave. A DNA test has now led Paul to this man, Paul Jack, who was 16 when his girlfriend got pregnant. She delivered a healthy baby. Dr. Hicks told them the child was stillborn. TLC cameras were there as Paul Raymond met his biological father for the first time. Welcome, my son, to the Jack family. <laughs> it's a miracle. 57 years in the making, he can finally hug the son he was told had died at birth. I'm very fortunate to have him. Very fortunate. It was like being reborn again. A Hicks baby reunited at last with the father he never knew he had.